The Life and Sad Ending of Christine Baranski. Christine Baranski was born Christine Jane Baranski on May 2, 1952, in Buffalo, New York, U.S. to Virginia and Lucian Baranski, who edited a Polish-language newspaper. Her grandparents are both actors in the Polish theater. She attended high school at the Villa Maria Motherhouse Complex. At age 19 at the Juilliard School, she was awarded $1,000 for living expenses as the most hardworking, economically needy student. Baranski later acknowledged spending the money to spend two months in Europe. She earned her bachelor's degree from Juilliard in 1974. She auditioned for the role of Princess Leia in Star Wars, Episode 4, A New Hope in 1977. In 1980, Baranski first appeared on stage in Playwrights Horizons, and two years later she also appeared at the Manhattan Theatre Club with Sally and Marcia. Her next performance on stage in Tom Stoppard's The Real Thing, which earned her the prestigious Tony Award in 1984. Not stopping there, she also participated in several other plays including Her Lieberly, The House of Blue Leaves, Rumors. In her acceptance speech for her second Tony Award for the Broadway play Rumors, she announced that her win made her the 100th person to ever receive an award for working on or appearing in a Neil Simon production in film, television, or theater. Five years later, she appeared in the film Reversal of Fortune in 1990, in which she again played a woman having an affair with a character played by Irons, who this time won an Oscar for his performance. May 28, 1991. Starred in the first production of Terence McNally's play Lips Together, Teeth Apart with Swoozie Kurtz, Nathan Lane, and Anthony Heald. Before hitting it big on the TV series Cybill in 1995, she had already completed close to 20 years' success in New York theater, both on and off Broadway, garnering wins in all major acting areas, later winning an Emmy Award as well. Then, in 2000, Baranski appeared in Welcome to New York and in 2003, she appeared in an NBC drama titled Happy Family with John LaRoquette. In 2005, Baranski continued to star in the ABC film Adopted alongside Bernadette Peters. That same year she played Jim Clancy's mother Faith Clancy in Ghost Whisperer. Her career was even more successful. In 2009 she starred in The Big Bang Theory, A Psychiatrist. The same year, she appeared in The Maternal Capacitance and the role helped her receive four Emmy nominations for her recurring role. In 2016, Baranski played the role of Diane Lockhart in the CBS series The Good Wife that earned her the Primetime Emmy Award for Best Supporting Actress in a TV Series. The following year, she joined the type of film that began airing on CBS and then CBS All Access, in which her character joined another law firm after being forced back to work. In personal life, Baranski with husband Matthew Cowles. The couple has two daughters, Isabel Cowles and Lily Cowles. Baranski and her husband raised their daughters without television, disapproving of the sexual content and violence on the small screen. Lily Cowles is an alumna of Princeton University. Probably, right now is her worst time when her health is slowly deteriorating. Thank you for listening to the story about the life of Christine Baranski. Like and comment on your opinion in the comments section below.